In this video, let's take a quick look at applying a scale factor to a traverse. We do that in the closure view, or that's one of the places we can do it inside of Traverse PC. So I want to open up a small control traverse here. And uh, I can say, for whatever reason, I want to scale this. Now, uh, those of you who are familiar with the geodetic uh, functions inside of Traverse PC know that it's real easy for me to pick a distance that is at project elevation or I can uh, have Traverse PC apply a mean course convergence based on the elevation or a specific factor. Well, it's that same factor that we can also apply then uh, in the closure view. Let's take a look at that. I'm going to go into the closure view. And I'm going to tell Traverse PC I want to apply this scale factor. So I can go ahead and enter that factor, whatever it is I want to use, and hit OK. Traverse PC is going to uh, inverse, basically, between the coordinates, starting with the initial point in the traverse, and apply that factor to the inverses. So it's going to tell me, here's the factor that it applied, and then each of the points is going to show me how much it adjusted. And I would expect these to be pretty small, because that's a pretty small factor, um, and uh, not very much distance involved here. But I can get the uh, linear error and relative error at each point based on that uh, factor that was applied. And I could certainly change the decimals here and would probably pick up that factor that was applied on each of these coordinates. 